Weather Authority local weather forecast. Welcome back. Well, it's been another warm day all across the desert southwest in the past several days. I mean, we had temperatures in the 80s and even right now we're still seeing some areas still hanging out in the 80s and we're cooling off just a little bit in some areas as well. We're starting to see some upper 70s starting to roll in. So a cooling trend is on the way as we head into our Wednesday. So we do have this next storm system that is going to cool down our temperatures just a little bit for tomorrow. So we will start to see more of those upper 70s come up for our Wednesday. Wednesday afternoon. Also breezy and windy conditions is what I'm also looking out for and increasing in some rain opportunities as well for right here in the desert southwest. So we do have this active weather pattern and even looking past that last week as well. I mean, ongoing storm activity for California. So heavy rain, very light um, accumulations of snow in those higher elevations, but mainly it's that heavy rain and that storm system is starting to move here in the desert southwest. So that is going to increase our chance for some storm activity as early as tonight and even into tomorrow. So here's what I'm looking at as of right now. We're seeing mainly just some heavy clouds out there. So very cloudy skies did see some storm development within the area. But even then, I mean, mainly our big um, act, our big opportunities for some rain is looking for tomorrow morning. So that's what I'm looking out for. But first off, we're going to start off with these winds. So they are going to start to pick up come the evening, mainly looking for Imperial Valley. So we can expect some gust around 20 to even 30 miles per hour at times. So we do have that potential for some breezy to windy conditions and going into early tomorrow morning those winds will start to move into um, Yuma County areas as well so just expect tomorrow to be pretty on the breezy side and also to looking out for that rain so I'll get to that in just a moment let's go ahead and take a quick peek now on our air quality index sponsored by Imperial County Air Pollution Control District well, it's looking very good for the valley, so overall no concerns there. But this is what is the main impacts for us tomorrow. So mainly looking at early tomorrow morning around 2 o'clock is when we could have that potential for some storm development within the valley and then that'll trickle in even for Yuma County areas as well. So it's looking very lightly or likely for those rain opportunities come tomorrow morning and then as we go into the afternoon those um, rain will move on out and we will still be holding on some cloud cover and we do have potential for some more rain as we go into tomorrow evening as well. So I'll be looking at that closely but just be prepared for tomorrow morning as we are going to start our Wednesday on the wet side. So we do have that potential for rain showers and also with that rain, we do have some rain accumulation that is also possible. Now, again, this is just an estimate on what we can expect, but we do have that possibilities for some um, rain accumulation, which is good for the desert southwest because we've been having very dry conditions over the past several days with those warmer temperatures. And for the rest of the week and going into next week as well, I mean, temperatures for now are going to be hanging out in the 70s and then we'll eventually see some 80s here and there. But all in all, temperatures are going to still stay pretty comfortable and cooler than normal as we hang out in the 70s for now. And even we'll have those clouds also staying with us. But mainly for tomorrow is when all that active weather is really supposed to be occurring within the area. So just be prepared for an active Wednesday for tomorrow. Back to you, Jessica and Scott. Thank you. I'm looking forward to a little rain, Melissa.